Welcome to the Transitions Daily Podcast. Transitions Daily is an online recovery group that offers a daily distribution of popular recovery resources accompanied by a secret Facebook group for discussion. We hope you enjoy today's readings. This is Transitions Daily for February 11th, read by Sarah M. from Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. AA Thoughts for the Day Miracles Since these things have happened among us, they can happen with you. Should you wish them above all else and be willing to make use of our experience, we are sure they will come. The age of miracles is still with us. Our own recovery proves that. Alcoholics Anonymous, page 153. Thought to Consider Don't give up before the miracle happens. AA Acronyms Hope Happy Our Program Exists Just for Today From Into Action On awakening, let us think about the 24 hours ahead. We consider our plans for the day. Before we begin, we ask God to direct our thinking, especially asking that it be divorced from self-pity, dishonest, or self-seeking motives. 4th edition, Alcoholics Anonymous, page 86. Daily Reflections The Limits of Self-Reliance We asked ourselves why we had them. Fears. Wasn't it because self-reliance failed us? Alcoholics Anonymous, page 68. All of my character defects separate me from God's will. When I ignore my association with Him, I face the world and my alcoholism alone and must depend on self-reliance. I have never found security and happiness through self-will, and the only result is a life of fear and discontent. God provides the path back to Him and to His gift of serenity and comfort. First, however, I must be willing to acknowledge my fears and understand their source and power over me. I frequently ask God to help me understand how I separate myself from Him. Copyright 1990, Alcoholics Anonymous World Services, Inc. As Bill Sees It Self-Confidence and Willpower When first challenged to admit defeat, most of us revolted. We had approached AA expecting to be taught self-confidence. Then we had been told that so far as alcohol was concerned, Self-confidence was no good whatever. In fact, it was a total liability. There was no such thing as personal conquest of the alcoholic compulsion by the unaided will. From the 12 and 12, page 22. It is when we try to make our will conform with God's that we begin to use it rightly. To all of us, this was a most wonderful revelation. Our whole trouble had been the misuse of willpower. We had tried to bombard our problems with it, instead of attempting to bring it into agreement with God's intention for us. To make this increasingly possible is the purpose of AA's 12 steps. That's also from the 12 and 12, page 40. Big book quote. The greatest enemies of us alcoholics are resentment, jealousy, envy, frustration, and fear. From Alcoholics Anonymous 4th Edition to Employers page 145. 24 hours a day, AA thought for the day. If we're going to stay sober, we've got to learn to want something else more than we want to drink. When we first came into AA, we couldn't imagine wanting anything else so much or more than drinking. So we had to stop drinking on faith, on faith that someday we really would want something else more than drinking. But after we've been in AA for a while, We learn that a sober life can really be enjoyed. We learn how nice it is to get along well with our family, how nice it is to do our work well, whether at home or outside, how nice it is to try to help others. Have I found that when I keep sober, everything goes well for me? Meditation for the day. There is almost no work in life so hard as waiting, and yet God wants me to wait. All motion is more easy than calm waiting, and yet I must wait until God shows me His will. So many people have marred their work and hindered the growth of their spiritual lives by too much activity. 
If I wait patiently, preparing myself always, I will be some day at the place where I would be. And much toil and activity could not have accomplished the journey so soon. Prayer for the day. I pray that I may wait patiently. I pray that I may trust God and keep preparing myself for a better life. Hazelden Foundation, P.O. Box 176, Center City, Minnesota, 55012. I'm Sarah, and I'm an alcoholic. We hope you enjoy today's readings. You can also receive Transitions Daily via email and discuss today's readings in our secret Facebook group. So for more information, go to dailyaaemails.com today. Other than the 24 hours a day reading, unless otherwise specified, all quotes copyright Alcoholics Anonymous World Services, Inc. 1952, 1957, 1967, 1973, 1975, 1976, 1980, 1981, 1984, 1985, 1988, or 2001.